This is the Southern California High School where classes have resumed after a spring break. We meet Zach Seiler, the big shot school president whom every girl on the campus wants to date. After reuniting with his two close friends, Dean and Preston, Zach looks for his girlfriend Taylor, but she's nowhere to be found. Eventually, when he meets her, Zach finds out that Taylor has cheated on him with a reality TV star named Brock Hudson. This discovery leads to their breakup. Meanwhile, we see Lainey in an art workshop, where the teacher asks Lainey to find herself in her creations. Back at the school, the campus DJ announces Zach and Taylor's breakup over the radio, which makes Zach even more embarrassed. But he consoles himself by claiming that Taylor is replaceable with any girl in the school. But Dean disagrees and challenges Zach to turn any random girl from school into a prom queen in six weeks. Zach accepts the challenge, and the trio goes around the school looking for a girl for him. After scanning the entire school, Dean chooses Lainey Box, an awkward and unpopular art student. Immediately, Zach tries to befriend her, but she ignores his advances and stays away from him. At home, Zach's sister Mackenzie tells him that if he wants to impress her, he needs to put in a little effort and find out about Lainey's interests. The next day, Zach goes to meet Lainey at a local restaurant, where she works. Once again, Lainey tries her best to ignore him as much as possible, but he keeps talking to her. But persuaded by her friend Jesse, Lainey reluctantly invites him to a small theater lounge where she will perform. Zach arrives at the Jester Theater, where he sees Lainey on the stage. Objectively, he seems very impressed by her performance, but Lainey does not want him around. So, intending to deter him, she calls Zach to perform on stage. Having no options, he agrees and gets on the stage. Zach manages to improvise a routine with his hacky sack, which amazes the audience. Now, at this point, it's clear that even Lainey is impressed with him. However, she still rejects him when he attempts to charm her again. And on the other hand, we see that Taylor and her celebrity boyfriend Brock are not getting along, as he's too obsessed with himself. This movie revolves around a high school favorite, Zach, who is dumped by his prom queen girlfriend for some slimy TV star. On the rebound, he accepts a bet from his best friend that he can turn Lainey, a geeky girl, into the school's prom queen. Naturally, Zach falls in love with her, which leads to other complications. Now back to the video. Zach shows up at Lainey's house where he gets to know more about her father, Wayne. As usual, Lainey tries to avoid him as much as possible and rejects Zach's offer to go to the beach. However, when Zach insists on staying the whole afternoon at her house playing with her brother, Lainey is forced to go to the beach with him. There, they meet Dean and Preston, and together, they play beach volleyball and have a really good time. At the end of the day, Lainey gets invited to a party later that night at Preston's house. She lies to them saying she's busy, but after some convincing, Lainey eventually agrees to go. Realizing that Lainey refrains herself from such social gatherings being insecure about her looks, Zach tells her sister Mac to give her a makeover. After the makeover, Zach is blown away by her cute look and genuinely starts liking her. Everyone at the party is surprised to see Lainey in her new look. Taylor is also there with Brock, who does a funny routine in front of everybody and embarrasses Taylor. Not just that, Taylor is jealous of Lainey and publicly humiliates her, bringing her to tears. Lainey confesses that all this time she avoided places like these because of people like her and rushes out of the house in humiliation. Zach quickly goes after her to console her as she slips on the road and breaks into tears. Zach tries his best to calm her down, but Lainey doesn't listen to him and urges him to go home. The next day at school, Lainey is surprised to see all the attention she's getting from other students. It turns out that she's been nominated for prom queen along with Taylor. Just then, one of Taylor's close friends, Katarina, receives an emergency message along with her other besties. From there, they rush to meet Taylor who is seen crying in her car. She reveals to them that Brock dumped her, leaving her utterly heartbroken. Later that day, Zach and his team lose a football match against their rivals since Zach was not in his zone. Dean points out that since Zach has been single for quite some time, he's showing withdrawal symptoms from not getting laid. Jokingly, he also suggests that Zach should get it on with Lainey. When Zach tells him that Lainey is a sweet person, Dean hints that maybe he should give it a try. Hearing such things from his best friend provokes him. This results in the two of them falling out with each other as Zach storms out of the locker room. Meanwhile, on the school campus, Jesse is seen organizing the advertisement banners for Lainey's chance at the prom queen. The same is done by Taylor and her friends to make sure she wins the competition instead of Lainey. Zach goes by Lainey's house and finds her painting in the basement. He's amazed to see her art and praises her for a portrait of her mother. 
When he asks about her mother, Lainey reveals that her mother died of cancer when she was very young, but to this day she has never cried about it. Ever since then, Lainey has been taking care of her brother Simon and their father. This situation with her family is why she shuts down people when they approach her. As they share their stories, Zach opens up about his father, who's been pressuring him to go to Dartmouth for college. His father also went to the same college and wants his son to be just like him. However, Zach doesn't want to wish for any of this and wants to decide on his own. Amidst their conversation, Zach leans in to kiss Lainey. But when she jokes that it's just to get her vote for prom king, he pulls back. At that moment, Zach realizes that he's with Lainey just because of the stupid bet with Dean and rushes out of her house, leaving Lainey in confusion. The next day at school, Lainey discusses her encounter with Zach the other day with Jesse in the cafeteria. Moments later, Simon arrives on the scene, but some seniors started bullying him by showing him adult magazines. Soon, Zach arrives in the cafeteria and saves Simon from the bullies. Now, after the falling out with Zach, the simp master Dean tries to get back at him and asks Lainey to be his prom date. Lainey immediately refuses his offer, but Dean tries to manipulate her by lying about Zach still being in love with Taylor. A part of Lainey doesn't want to believe any of that and just stays quiet the whole time, while Dean tries to convince her to prom anyhow. When Zach comes home, he sees his father inside his room with the acceptance letters that he had kept hidden. Then, an inevitable argument ensues between the father and the son. Irritated by his father's controlling behavior, Zach tells him to stop trying to fix his own mistakes through his son. However, his father simply replies that he's worried about his future and that he should start making decisions before it's too late. The next day at school, after being humiliated by Brock, Taylor cozies up to Zach in hopes of patching up with him again. When Zach turns her down, she reveals to him that Dean has already asked Lainey to the prom. Hearing this, Zach gets furious and goes to confront Dean for his manipulation. However, things don't go exactly as Zach had thought. Dean reveals the whole challenge thing to Lainey, forcing a public confession from Zach. As a result, a furious Lainey rushes from the room, followed by the simp master Dean. Lainey is now in her basement apartment painting a portrait of herself as a clown, while Zach continuously calls her on the phone. Sometime later, her father comes down to the basement to have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation with her. He wholeheartedly admits how Lainey has been taking the parental role in the house ever since the death of her mother. But now, he wants her to have a life of her own, like any other teenager. Finally, her father convinces her to go to the prom night as well, claiming that a young, handsome man is waiting for her in the hall. Thinking that it's Zach waiting for her, Lainey rushes up to meet him. However, it's actually Dean who has come there to ask her to the prom. After being manipulated by Dean, Lainey eventually agrees to go with him. On the other hand, thinking that he won't be able to reconcile with Lainey, Zach takes his sister Mac to the prom. Zach starts looking for Lainey at the party, hoping to clear the misunderstanding between them. However, he's quickly interrupted by Taylor, who is still obsessed with him. She forces Zach to dance with her, while we see Lainey dancing with Dean. Throughout the dance, Zach makes several attempts to make contact with Lainey, but he fails every time. As the dance continues for a while, Mac meets up with Jesse, who is sitting alone. When the dance is over, Dean leaves Lainey for a while as she's approached by her art teacher. She tells Lainey that she loved the portrait of her mother and that she sent applications to prestigious art colleges in the country on her behalf. Hearing this, Lainey becomes happy after a long, long time. But just then, her sight falls upon Zach, who is seen hugging Taylor. Now, once again, her heart sinks a little seeing him with someone else. On the other hand, the simp master Dean boasts of his plan to seduce Lainey that night. He claims that he is super close to getting laid with Lainey, and that he's even booked a hotel room for the occasion. However, none of his friends believe him, not even Preston. After everyone has left the washroom, it's revealed that Lainey's friend Jesse has overheard everything. He rushes outside to meet up with Mac and explains everything to her. Down in the prom hall, the principal gets ready to explain the prom king and prom queen. Just as everyone is expected, Zach is crowned the prom king for the night. However, to everyone's surprise, Taylor is crowned as prom queen, even though most of them had hoped for Lainey to win. Moments later, Jesse and Mac arrive downstairs to warn Zach, who has already taken the stage with Taylor. After learning about Dean's plan, Zach rushes after Lainey, who's already left with Dean. On the way, Zach calls several hotels in the area to know exactly which hotel Dean is taking Lainey to. Meanwhile, we see Lainey arriving at her home with a disappointed look on her face. She sees her father and her brother sitting on the couch, but soon the camera pans out to reveal Zach standing there waiting for her. He starts revealing Dean's motive, but Lainey stops him and explains that she figured that out herself just a while ago. Lainey also tells him how she avoided Dean's advances by using a safety horn that she carries with herself all the time. 
After that, Zack confesses his true feelings and apologizes for the stupid challenge that he took part in. He also tells her that due to the bet, he now has a clash with his own best friend. As they talk to each other, they slowly start dancing and kissing by the pool. When Lainey asks Zack about the challenge, Zack says he will honor the terms, but it will only be revealed on graduation day. It's now the day of the graduation ceremony, and everyone is seen waiting for their name call. When it's finally Zack's turn, we see him sitting naked at the ceremony. Why? Because he stayed true to his words and honored the terms of the challenge. In the end, Zack managed to impress Lainey, but the real question is, did we manage to impress you with the video? If we did, watch this video now.